Thanks, Michael. I'm now here with Bannock County Commissioner Terrell Tubby, but today he is here as Captain Tubby. So tell us about uh, the event Field of Heroes that will be going on this weekend, Memorial Day weekend. So starting today at 10 o'clock, we'll uh, have our opening ceremonies. The Field of Heroes is there uh, to remember all uh, military personnel that have been killed in uh, the continuing war on terror. So there's about 7,000 markers that have been put out to, for remembrance. So it's a, it's a pretty uh, somber experience to be able to, to remember those that have uh, paid the ultimate price for our country. And talk about a little bit, on Memorial Day weekend, people like to get out there and have fun. Is that something that you feel is, is OK and something people should be doing? Um, I, I definitely think you should. Uh, we're here to remember those uh, uh, soldiers, sailors, marine, and airmen that have uh, uh, have been lost, but uh, one of my good friends, Corporal Rafael Rodriguez Ruda, was killed in Afghanistan, and I could tell you that uh, he would be out there celebrating and encouraging everybody to go celebrate. That's that's the point: is to remember these people and what they've given. So uh, people should have a good time this weekend. Yeah, and you're wearing your captain's outfit today. So what what's, what's that about? What are you going to be doing today? Captain's uniform. So I have been uh, asked to MC the event today. So. Uh, uh, at 10 o'clock, I'll be out there uh, uh, opening ceremonies for the Field of Heroes. So um, I am fortunate. I get the two best jobs in the world. <laughs> I'm, I'm a county commissioner, but I'm also the uh, a captain in the Army, and I command the Ford Support Company for the 321st Engineer Battalion. Uh -huh. So it's, it, it's good. It's a, it's a good job to have. Yeah, so what does this uh, weekend kind of mean to you? Um, like I said, after uh, serving in Iraq and Afghanistan, I've, I've had several people that I've known that have been killed in action. And for me, it, it is a, a, a sombering uh, time. But at the same time, uh, with uh, my family and other people, we do get to go out and understand what the sacrifice that those individuals have given us. And so uh, we remember them, uh, we honor them, and we make sure that uh, we continue to do so. Awesome. So if people want to come today, what do they have to do? Just show up? Uh, it opens at 10 o'clock at Century High School. It'll be open till dusk until Monday night. Monday night, we will have our closing ceremonies at 6 o'clock that I'll also be conducting. Is there anything people can do to help if they want to help? Um, we'll give you some information, and for next year, we'll uh, have you help come uh, set up, or you can help come take down uh, after Monday night. Okay, awesome. Thanks for coming on. Thank you. Coming up on KPVI News Today, we'll bring you your KPVI News Today headlines.